So after we're getting our tanks blown up last time, we have some maintenance to do. So we gotta go fix some stuff. Enjoy. I suppose I should probably get out of bed over here, huh? You probably get out of bed? Wow. Ooh. You fall out of bed. Well, I fell out of bed. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So that's the big, the big news. The big news. The big news <laughs> of the day. Started an hour early. <laughs> yeah, which is even earlier for folks in Europe with uh, daylight savings. And then we'll have daylight savings next week. Is that next week? I think so. Yeah. Uh, all right. Either way, the the long and short of it is we're trying to extend the Sunday stream time. We're not entirely yeah. sure what's going to be the best way to do it with our schedule, so we're sort of experimenting. The 12 to 4 Pacific will be the main chunk of time. It's just if we add time at the start or at the end or both. Yeah. Clean up my uh, GPS signals a little bit. Okay. Good on food. And then I will have a sparkling water. You want a sparkling water? I'll have a sparkling water. It's true, Turnip. The barracks didn't kill us today. True. Add at the start, please. What do you... The time. What do you mean? The stream time. Like, start early. Oh, start early. Yeah. Because we... <laughs> there's the two systems of that, where for folks in Europe, it's probably easier if we start early. For folks in North America, it's probably easier if we, we go later. Yeah. Depending on the time zone, though. So... Because obviously we're in Pacific time, so everything is behind us, or is ahead of us, rather time-wise. We're we're last. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's here's John. John is having a a tough time. Yep, apparently. Here. Uh oh. Uh, there's a skill miner. But yes, open oh. to discussion on what y'all are interested in. It's a bit damaged that skill miner. In terms of. The, the consensus was that everybody would like a longer stream. Nobody said, don't do a longer stream. So we took that as, you probably want a longer stream. Yep. There's a yellow miner napping in the magnesium mine. All right, let's go do some base maintenance need... and see what this we can still... fix up. Too dark. Let me get a light for that area. Let's fix this go miner. Uh, na, 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 na. Or did I put the light here? That's this one. Okay, construction components and interior, please. Can I grab Weld that from bed me? A on. Construction. Oh, jeez. That everything? I don't know how many I need. That's everything. Uh, this should be the antenna. That many. Oh, that should off. be enough, right? We'll stick a light here as well. Okay. Let's pop out of here. Nope, we can't stick a light there. Oh, it's because of the weird... Um... It's because of the half blocks. <laughs> okay, so maybe I need to do some ceiling lighting. Probably. Okay, I can do that. Let me park this over here for now. I could line it up with these ones, actually. That might be a good... That might be a good call! Could I close this? Of course I can. Just the one here? Should, do I need to open all of them? And then close it? Is that uh, its particular... I think... Proclivity? I don't, I don't know anything about how that I gotta works, open the whole so. thing. I don't know how that door is organized, so you may have to reorganize it. Oh, right! We the still boxing. have a uh, lawn ornament. We have another lawn ornament? Roger, roger. No, just this one. There we go. Well, how is everybody doing today? How are your weekends going? I don't know, how's your weekend going? Mm. It's going. Is it going? Going. <laughs> and did... 
<laughs> I want to say errands, but it was one errand on Saturday. It was just longer. <laughs> did uh, did you, Alien, did you see what I, what I did there? What happened when I did that? How do I want to line this up? Maybe if I get some steel blades. One is the remote control for the Hag D. Press one. Oh, I don't want those. I want these. It actually, it works. It works okay. pretty good. <laughs> I was like, oh. Here you go. <laughs> Like a trivia question on page We still shoot uh, unknown sickness, by the way. I'm, just, I'm, I'm feel, feeling like that. Yeah. You taking a down day? Turn up to relaxing. Excellent. You're well. Picked up your grandfather's drafting table. Oh, very cool. I'm gonna hop in with some superconductors from space to turn of town. Excellent. Yeah, that drafting table is gonna be very cool. No proper space. I mean, isn't that always the gist? The weekend is good, Helios. Let Playing Lord see. of the Rings, return to Moria all day and knitting. There you go. Are you feeling better today? All right, I've, I've found the page. Oh, trivia. The category is food culture. Ooh, I have no idea. Let's see. In what year was the first Michelin Guide published? A long time ago. Yeah. And for food culture, in what year was the first Michelin Guide published? Everyone knows that the first Michelin that the Michelin Guide still, and the first one in particular, was the cell tires, right? Yeah, right? It's like, is that what we're counting from? I don't know. Why, well, you gotta guess. <laughs> Trying to figure out how far. Maybe like here. That I'm gonna do it. Okay. And then if I line it up. Aha. Like so? Hmm. <laughs> right, Glacial? The soothing sound of very large guns. Very soothing. I totally forgot to put a landing gear on here. Aww. Uh, I see that the temperature of these lights has changed. Yes. Somebody has cooled them. Warmed them. Yeah, that's the right word. I did the opposite. Did. These ones are cool. Um, it's really not as cool as I am. You're so cool. Like, OMG, so cool. You are so cool. But is there no access point on these lights for me to control them? No, because they're... Uh, we don't have that mod. That mm. mod was surprisingly heavy. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Let me read the trivia question first. Can I? Can we do this? Yeah. We can. So the, the tires. Michelin tires. Because they wanted people to buy tires. So they're like, how do we encourage people to, to do things that involve driving? <laughs> yep. Basically. Restaurants. All right. What is the answer page? 511. Okay. In what year was the first Michelin Guide published? The book says the answer is 1900. Sounds on the dot. About right. 1900. Uh, batteries. Recharge. And thrusters off. 
thrusters off. Because then I have to figure out what these lights are set to. It's just recharge. I'm assuming that. it's what these lights are set to. If you use build vision on them. I, I have been looking at build vision. Wow. <laughs> okay. Where's my little scrap of paper? I'm just going to write this down <laughs> so I don't forget. And then they will all be the same. Okay, we're just going to drain the batteries on the Hag D. Drain the Hag D. Let that charge. And 152. There we go. Radius is 11.6. Yeah, I'm going to be switching a lot of lights. <laughs> it's not all thrusters. Bala. 1.5. Ha. Huh. That's part Intensity. of the problem. Uh, 0.7-ish. These will all be ish. Okay. Perfect. It's good, so Lord of the Rings Return to Moria is quite good, says Helios. But some pointers on what to do next. Not hand holding, but a clue would be nice. Got it. Building is good. The best feature is that you can craft from mats in your chests and pallets. Okay, cool. Oh, we have some extras. I see that. Be able to copy settings and paste them into the other lights. Oh, how do I do that? Never done that before. Okay. All right. Well, we'll see if we can just recharge. Oh, this I one. see copy settings. Do I just hit enter? Copy settings. Copy selected. That's hack D1 one dash one. Oops. One dash one. Okay. Did I do it? Let's see. Did I do all the things? We're both like, eh. <laughs> Trying to fix the stuff. Fix the stuff. Custom data. This is okay. 5 7. Mm -hmm. Might need to build a hangar so the ha so the, the skull miners can get in and out of the base more easily. So then where would I paste this? Open list menu, maybe? There we go. Should work better. Okay, that's those bits Maybe fixed. Yeah. I hope. Um, paste. Nope, that wasn't it. Okay, I'm gonna let the batteries do their thing and recharge. We come back to the base for a minute. Check on some other things. I have paste I saw that. here, but it's not pasting what I had copied. Did I copy it incorrectly? That's a potential. Apparently possible. That is a potential. It's probably very likely to. Was this a damaged okay, spot, let's alien? Restart my. Okay, so copy settings. This is what I want to do. Clicking. Do I want to open list and select all? So they were damaged, like, so this was damaged, right, Alien? Oop, I just went into Spectator and crashed. Three settings, copy all. Mm. I did that, okay. Wonder, I wonder if that mod did that. Did you get kicked? I crashed out. I was, I had been using the remote control and then I went to use mm. Spectator. And I nope. wonder if it broke. Oh, now it's on this one. No, how do I get back to the not list view? You scrolled the wrong direction. When, you, when you're when you first bringing up the menu, if you scroll down, oh. I think it brings. Ah, I see. Okay, so then copy settings. Hmm. 
and the new light. Target light, copy settings, paste. Okay, so they were missing completely. Okay, I'll try spectator again. And paste. I load back in, and if Spectator works, I can have a quick look around, and if Spectator doesn't work, I will just crash it, and then we'll have to wait for BD to fix that. <laughs> I have to scroll wheel to the paste option. We are not yet there. We have not yet sorted it. Let's try again. Did you hear that, team? You could hear Skoka's keyboard. Very yeah. clicky. Yeah, I have a clicky keyboard now. She has a, she has a uh, clicky keyboard. I don't know if that's going to bother people, though. <laughs> it's a clicky keyboard, but it's a clicky keyboard that uh, has a satisfying oh. kerchunk noise instead of just the clicky clicky. It's not clicky like mine. Yeah, it's kind of a muted clickiness. <laughs> It's kind of marbly. Yeah, that's true. Up. Okay, copy setting. Okay, I'm in the world. Click, paste. Let's try. Ah! Okay, I'm going to hit F8. Nope. Immediate we crash. We all did it collectively. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> that's that's problem. Oh, hey, Winter. Welcome. It's Goka's favorite game. It's excited. How are you today? Winter, welcome. I have a fancy keyboard. Thank you to all of the gifters on my throne wish list so I could get a new keyboard. Uh, oh, no. Over here. Hooray. <laughs> no. <laughs> Ugh. Welcome, O'Games. How are you doing today? But now I have a keyboard that's like an actual new fancy keyboard in the sense that it's not one that came with the pre-built PC <laughs> that I've been using. Using forever. For so many years. Yep. Uh... Okay, is that better? Turn off. Oh, I had my light off. Okay. That's encouraging. Uh, this one? All right, we did it. So now we have to just deal with this black hole over here. <laughs> How many blocks is that that I went? One, two, three, four. Go on the fifth one. Here, we can just do this. Just make a little line here. <laughs> One, two, three, four. So I gotta build it at the end there. I just Look at check. this. Math, counting, strategy. I'm gonna check the logs on the server, see if they saw anything. Nailed it. I don't think it did, because that was a client crash. Beauty. And it's time for a bad joke. All right, Winter, would you like to guess the answer to the bad joke? Nothing in the circle lock. Okay. Okay, so that's borked. Uh, I will not be able to do that or anything about that. You want to guess? Okay. All right. Let me just do this before the ability to do this the leaves my brain. And then we'll read a joke. A bad joke, hopefully. Look at that. 
I've done a very basic task. It Have took you. me a long time. Look at that! We have more appropriate lighting! Look at you. Woo! Now I have to do that for the rest of the base. Hello, games. How you doing? Okay, so I see we have... Okay, there's the green scope miner. The new one. Alien, were you planning on... Um... You wanted to put a hanger... Oh, you wanted to put a hanger on the deck above this and out the back, right? And then... Oh, hello, Jared. Thank you for your subscription. Jared. For 35 months, almost three years. Well done. All right. I have a bad joke. You can guess the answer to it. Oh, no. <laughs> this one is going to be good for this group, I find. I think. All right. What's... What is a foot long and slippery? What is a foot long and slippery? We weren't going to talk about that on stream. <laughs> Another hangar and exit past the garage deck hangar. Got to finish the new maintenance room. So garage deck past this hangar. All basic tasks on Paradiso take an inordinate amount of time. It is true. That's the Paradiso experience. See, we left, we've left a bunch of doors open. Okay, we'll just leave this as is. It doesn't smaller, have to be pretty. It just has to be lights. Smaller, more pressurized spaces is better than big open ones. So more smaller ones. As big right. pressurized spaces take up a bunch of resources on the server. Do they now? They do. In you go, and then... Look, our uh... Let's do tank is pretty good. 50 of those. We'll just take all of these. Yoink. Lovely. The base is actually holding up not bad. Uh, Jared? <laughs> uh. Hot dog. Sub sandwich in a bathtub. There is a welder. Average BLT at Subway's. True <laughs> freaky. <laughs> <laughs> a Costco hot dog covered in lube. A wet foot. That's a good one. Okay. <laughs> what is the conversion? The metric. These are a fun. A foot is thirty centimeters. Thirty-ish, yeah. Here I have, I have my crafting ruler here. Bar lifts. I see. Yes, thirty centimeters to twelve inches. All right, I'm gonna read. I'm gonna read the answer to the joke. Are we all ready? I don't know, are you? Ready? What's a foot long and slippery? A slipper. A slipper, wow. <laughs> wow. I, d I knew! It would be great, because this, this group would go in the, not this direction. <laughs> Hanger and exit past this room. Okay. <laughs> Oh, that that was excellent payoff. Excellent payoff. I like Alien. It's good. That's pretty good, right? Like that is a dad joke. Uh, so that means, and where is you want the hanger going out that way? So I'm, because if I'm this way, yeah, because the valley How walls dark it is this it? way. Very dark. Also very tall. Eventually, Maybe yes. what we okay. gotta do here is fill in the roof a little bit more. It'd be nice to figure out a good that spot good. for the. Um, it'd be nice to figure out a good spot for the sco miner so they could get in and out more easily. Uh, but with that in mind, I mean the vertical shaft's not a bad idea to be honest. The, with the sco miners, it's important to figure out what the path in and out would be for each one. So individual hangar doors, like immediately going outside is better for them because they, if they go have to go down a tunnel or something, they will eventually just crash into each other. Hmm. Yeah. Um, 
So you have to like think about their path and getting in and out of the hangar so that they don't overlap as much. Uh, but that not all not all slippers are twelve inches. Are tr it's true, but I think the bad joke, if I am inferring, is that a foot long, as in the size of your foot. So it, it tricked us all. Yes, it did. By thinking twelve inches when it's actually just the size of a, somebody's foot. Oh, I need to go check the hagby. But it's bad. That's that's the point. Control. Okay, let's get rid of that. Okay, charged. I have charged. Lovely. Okay, so maybe we fill this in. It's close. It's out of power. Probably won't make and it back. We can, but we can try. Lights. If I can remember how to get back to the base. Where did you go? Uh, took the magnesium mine. Took the Hagney to the magnesium mine. To save the other miner. But unfortunately, I left it in recharge. Mm -hmm. So it's sitting there out of power, but Stuff. this Hegdy is almost out of juice. So or this Hegdy is almost out of juice, but it's also empty. So we'll see. We can make it back in under two minutes of power. Good luck. The daddest of dad jokes. Exactly. Two minutes, one minute. Did you make it? 300 meters. Ooh. Combat phase no active. There we go. This will be like a interesting challenge to... 100 meters. You need some intense music for that. I'm How just intense. I know. <laughs> That's why we talked about my foot long and slippery. <laughs> I think everybody knows that you're intense. <laughs> I am very intense. <laughs> that was never in question. Nailed it. Good work. Oh, all right. You know what? This is going to take too long. Let's get a miner. I just took one. Well, just took one? there's two more in the lower hangar. So. See the lower hangar here. They're not currently programmed to do anything? They're not running, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Alien knows that you are a tent. <laughs> I know. Mm. Great, I'm gonna i I'm gonna borrow one of these. I'm resisting the urge to make a joke about you playing with my tent pole. <laughs> Yeah, Tilok says somebody needs to help final release some of the pent up tension, perhaps. <laughs> Off stream, preferably. <laughs> Can't do it. Everyone's here for my intense action. They're here for your intensity. To weapon drill.
Now, where is the skill miner? We'll just go straight across for the minute. There it is. And parked. Uh, oh, I see. Is that all I needed to do? Uh, grips, ejectors. I'm gonna block on off. Get some stuff out of there. This might be sufficient. Are we, are we ejectorizing or are we not ejectorizing? Mm. Think about it. Oh, oh, Games has got a joke for you. Should be fine. Should be fine. Oh, there's a joke. Okay. All right. Ready, everyone? Why was the police officer... Why was the police officer arrested after pulling people over? I think that's really? the correct... Really? Really? Why was the police officer arrested after pulling people over? He was caught flashing. <laughs> terrible. It's good. It's terrible. Good. It's terrible. <laughs> We need both of you work from home days. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, we're back at and this. This one doesn't have a, um, a camera yet. What? This go again. miner doesn't have a docking cam yet. Oh. Some of them have printing mishaps. All good. I can practice my not great parking. Reminds me that I need to. I probably need to replace this, the welders underneath the well pad, but maybe I should just f help finish. Um, yeah, this is. This aliens sufficient. new well pad instead. That might yeah. just be a better use of our time. Use our time. Actually, and if I do them, it might work better. This is like our second level. So I probably don't have to do heavy armor here. I could probably just do not heavy concrete. I could just do regular concrete, perhaps. Probably. Where are the freaking... Where is the entrance to this place? Let's get lost in this one. on the bar. Ah, got it. I didn't look. That's a me problem. Oh, we know. You don't get it. Wait. Uh. Oh. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Okay, we'll just do regular. Okay, let's go get Great. some parts. Because that'll be faster. We can have a roof. Alien needs to start working on those weld pads. I know. I know. It hasn't been slacking there. as much as some of the other denizens. I have been the, the slackingest, I think. It's true. I've been the most slacking. I I recognize my failure. That also reminds me. I was going to set up a sco miner. Um, or see if I could set up a, I should build a, a combat block or defensive combat block, um, and see if I can trigger the, the programmable blocks. Clipping that admission of her own shortcomings. I, I admit my shortcomings often. I just think there are a lot of folks who watch who are like, you're not doing it the way that I want you to do it, so you're doing it wrong. Or you play badly because you don't play the way that I think you should be. And I'm not saying this to anybody in particular. Those are just often the comments that I get. Skoka, have you heard that you're really bad at this game? <laughs> bad at this game. 
My favorite is still You're not that. playing it right. Okay. Back to... Let's go Miner. That reminds me. You need me to go look at that... Uh, quantum singularity that Alien ran into. The quantum singularity? You're using mod that I don't like and you shouldn't play with them. <laughs> <laughs> like, did you know that this is an open world game in which you can play however you want to? It's true. <gasps> it's true. And just because another person on the internet is playing it differently doesn't mean that it's the wrong way. I mean, I think you're wrong about that. I think you're wrong about everything. I I am a woman on the internet, therefore I am wrong. <laughs> I learned that one early. <laughs> Sounds like some of the viewers might not be able to play it right. Per perhaps, Tilok, I'm not saying anything. not my job to comment unless somebody is like i don't know how to do x y z can you help then absolutely make suggestions that's <laughs> it's all wrong everyone and everything is wrong okay let's try this can. Open world game? No, really, right? <gasps> you can just do whatever you want. There's not one right way. <gasps> that is incorrect. Oh my gosh. Oh, crashy, crashy this time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good skull miner and fly home. There's no such games. Exactly, oh games. Women don't exist on the interwebs. Or a trap. This is a long con. Yeah. Oh! And I fell. I think there's a shortcut now, Alien. We don't have to do this uh, hairpin anymore. Player disconnected. Delicious turnip juice. <laughs> someone, someone is on their, uh, their laptop. Uh -huh. Remoting into the server. His laptop is melting the granite table, table it's resting on. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> uh, that sounds about right. Oh gosh, the other day at work, because my computer, <laughs> my laptop for work is very old and it's not good. And I was uh, in the office on a Teams meeting and I had a couple of other things open. Silly me. But the fan was just like cranked on the laptop and I had my pen on the side of the computer and I picked it up to take some notes and it was like hot. I was like, I think the plastic on this might melt because the fan from the laptop was blowing right at it at such a temperature that it was like, oh, this isn't good. It was fine, it's totally fine, very safe. The yellow skull miner has been returned. I mean, if, yeah, that's exactly it, Go Games. I mean, again, everybody can play exactly the way we want. Mm -hmm. I've curated a list of mods as part of this server that I'm like, I want them to be this way. On this server, you have to play the way that Final wants. So you have to just <laughs> determine if you like that. Yeah. <laughs> Basically. That is that is the bias. There is the trade-off. Okay. We've saved a skull miner today. Woohoo! Got some more magnesium out of it. Let's see. 
Let's check our ingots situation. Mm -hmm. We have many much iron. Plenty of nickel. Good. Plenty of silicon. Turnip was trying to fast travel to his dock ship via respawn, and Essie decided it should not. <laughs> Uh, Cobalt is... The game plays you. Fine. Exactly. You know, we have another enough gold to make another Medusa if you want, Alien. That's very true. Oh, games. I honestly don't... I think I would get in trouble if I tried to do that for the, the work laptop. We almost have enough platinum for a base shield, actually. IT department would be like, you're not allowed! So we could save that gold and build a base shield if we get some more platinum. Ariel J. Walker, welcome. Thank you for following. How are you today? Okay, those are that done. Alien, I would say I wouldn't worry so much about this docking pad. I would I would focus on your on your uh, hangar at the back because this magnesium mine isn't going to last much longer, right? So. Dominator, welcome. Hello. Welcome, welcome. You're not too shabby, Serial. Excellent. How goes the space engineering? It is going. I learned how to copy and paste light settings today from everybody. Dude. That's fun. I learned a new thing. Making concrete. It all started because I needed to put some lights in here, but then we didn't have a roof to put the lights on. So I'm doing that. I don't know how far I should extend this roof. Should I just go all the way to where the conveyors are? Does it, would anybody mind or do they need to be open access? What, say that again? Uh, this roof situation here, can I work it all the way to the other side or do these Conveyors need to be open access. Nope. If you're going to nope. seal them in, that's actually better. So, it's better? Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Got it. Let's ask. Uh, Let's just ask. make sure that the they're completely sealed. Um, More welding. Food and water. I need one of... Actually, I think I just need one of these. Maybe I should remove that. I'm trying to figure out what the design system is here. IT departments are generally full of people who don't know F all about computers. It's I feel like if I can recommend something to the ID department and I am not at all skilled. If I can recommend something that works, that is troubling. It is. It is troubling. That is what I will say. <laughs> is that an unknown signal for you? I have an unknown signal, yeah. Okay. It's good to know it's that's probably going to be a cow printed helmet. I'm going to miss out. Uh, you used to work in one Dominator. So you have first hand experience in the department. I only have some dealing with it. Uh, alien. If I replace all these welders and put them in, that's fine with you. I can actually put them in and I'll use, because I have all the DLC, it might work better. Okay, I will do that now. About me to work in tech. I do work in tech. I don't do the, the most techy part of the tech. I'm a content friend. So I do writing, I do information architecture, general strategy of how it's supposed to happen. But I don't actually build.
I really wish that uh, we could find a setting that would keep Weapon Core from firing on the unknown signals. Uh, and what do you want to call this weld pad? Alien? Alright, how am I gonna make this happen in the way that I want it to happen? Uh, empty on. Weld pad B? Sure. Easy. Right, I feel like Space Engineers is, is giving you a sign to be like, take a break. <laughs> Don't do it. Oh, hello. No, NCA, yeah, no, it's... Neff. Neff, that's it. Make the connection on my brain. <laughs> How are you today? It is a cool cave, right? We have a couple different areas of the cave, too. It's easy and profitable. I mean, it's neither easy nor profitable, unfortunately. <laughs> I mean, doing uh, content and information architecture work properly, the best practices are very easy. It's getting everybody to agree on them and actually do them. It's very complicated. It's the, uh, it's because we use Weapon Core oh, games. Oh, I thought it was a cool section. Okay. All right. I see. I could just build a whole other line of blocks. Maybe that's the best approach. We'll just do that. Or do we want another door here? I don't know. Do you want another door there? Just posing the question. Sounds like you want another door there. I can just add a door. Instead of bricking all of this in. You're pretty well, you think, Neff? Mostly slept. I mean, I'm jealous. <laughs> I'm not very good at sleeping. Did you see Turnip's comment? Did I? Uh, ki admin kick out of OR44. You can spawn back in. Uh, if you load into OR44 turnip. Uh, oh, I see. Load to the spawn list for a at the end of the Okay. Uh, maybe I can. Give me a minute. Uh, actually, you know what I can do? I can actually just delete your... Well, it's maybe not what I want to do. Trying to think, is there another command I can use? Oh, what are these ones? I can just go look at the door. That would be helpful. That is a thing I can do. What are these ones? You are a half sliding hatch door. Gotcha. Uh. Go back to where I had that space. I could spell it correctly too. Hmm. Half sliding hatch door. Ew. Beauty. I'm trying to Beauty think. To Is there another way for me to get to turn up to? Would it have to go here? Was that you crashing just now, turnip? Do 
You're a motorcycle mechanic. Oh, okay. Very yeah? cool. Yeah, okay. Sometimes you think it'd be nice to work behind a desk. I mean, I spent a lot of time working behind a desk, and sometimes I would be like, I'm like, it's nice to not work behind a desk. <laughs> hmm. Do we all want what we can't have? Is there a Nexus move command? I can't remember. Um, let's put it here. Yes. <laughs> On my my sixth hour of Microsoft Teams meetings, I'm like, why did I do this to myself? Why did I choose this? It's the third. Okay, so it's the same thing. I bet you it's got to do with third person. Uh. Yeah, it's a third person mod and it's when you're also in a it's because it uses the spectator camera to look at the bed base. Okay. Uh, when a player is trying to use the um, respawn menu. Okay, so with that in mind, that means I have to take the server down. Right now? Yep. Okay, I go to... Okay. Not maybe what I want, but... That's yeah. not where I want to be. Because the miner won't fit. Okay, I might have to adjust this. Is there a chair over there? Yeah, there is. Sit down. And okay, I go to. Hold on, I'm not there yet. Logs. Move. Close. Save. I don't think this will work. Okay, I'm Trivious. in the bed. Okay, ah, one second. We'll do a bunch of trivia. Excellent. How you make concrete blocks with the welder, right? <laughs> <laughs> Obviously. Obviously how you do it. page for trivia questions about tomatoes freaky we've found the trivia page for you and hello Calgar welcome how are you doing today okay that's that Okay, let's go oh boy. all of these. <laughs> I'm excited to see how much this trivia book gets wrong in terms of tomatoes. Gonna have 10 trivia questions? Probably so. <laughs> Oops. Either. Let's start it. All right. We can Again. Do, we'll do some tomato trivia for you. Um, okay. Trivia question. Where did tomatoes originate? Where did tomatoes originate? Big. Configuration. Torch. Auto start. Start. Are you supposed to answer this? Yes. You can answer. No Googling. Or if you do Google it, just don't type it in. We don't we don't want to cheat. There's no prize. 
prize is merely knowing a job well done. Configuration. Mods. Remove. If you, knew, you learned it in school. March auto start. Yeah. Well, see, that's the whole part of trivia. You gotta, you gotta stick to your start. Stick to your guns. It's three. Move. We got a whole bunch of different guesses. Config, configuration. North America, South America, start. Spain, Amazon, Indonesia, we go. Italy. This is a lot of options. Let's see what the book says. <laughs> we can't always trust it either. <laughs> okay, where did tomatoes originate? What is this? 355. Uh, the book says the answer is Western South America. Western South America. You're right, Neff. Okay, there we go. They were trying to be as specific as possible, I suppose. Apparently, I died. You died? Don't work. <laughs> All right. Since we have Freaky here, I'll do a couple more tomato trivia questions. <laughs> oh, I actually, I don't know what this is. Okay. What is the knuckle of a tomato? What is the knuckle of a tomato? Never heard that before. Have you heard of that final? A knuckle of a tomato? Yeah, have you heard of that? I mean... If it's anything like my giant moose knuckle. <laughs> <laughs> what? Sorry? Interesting phrasing. Right, you with like a finger of the tomato? Does the tomato have fingers? <laughs> the place where the stem attaches. I would assume they're trying to make it equivalent to something that we would know more readily. This. The tip of the tomato that can rot, you typically call that the nose. The nose rot. Okay, now I need to sleep. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, where, what is the knuckle of a tomato? The book says the answer, <laughs> oh gosh. Where okay. the calyx joins the stem? They've added another word I don't know. Where the calyx joins the stem. <laughs> so the top. <laughs> okay, here we go. Now I'm sleeping. Yeah, sure. Perfect. Okay. I have been fed. I have been watered. I have slept. Now I go back upstairs. All right. What else have we got for tomatoes? Oh, a true or false. Perfect. We love true or falses. You know what you should do too, Skoka? What? Um, you should put another airtight hanger door on uh, the door down here. Mm -hmm. It's like, right, mm -hmm. like uh, the space outside of the barracks. Yes. Because it's another big open space that then is exposed to voxels. Huh? Because that way we can seal it off. Just while you're finishing doors and walls and things. Roger, roger. While I'm doing general base maintenance. I am also working on base maintenance today. Excellent.
Oh yeah, look at that. The lighting, so much better. Okay. This is a true or false. The, and this is still about tomatoes. The optimal temperature for pollination is 18.5 degrees Celsius or 65.3 Fahrenheit. True or false. The optimal temperature for pollination is 18.5 Celsius or 65.3 Fahrenheit. <laughs> Freaky the short version or long. <laughs> Whatever you want to give us. I always give her the long version. Like so. I think this is gonna work. Do I have a steel plate on my person? I do. Okay, will this place... Ah! Oh, there's a BD. We found BD finally. Because I should have... Yeah, right there. And this isn't going to be the most beautiful, but this is what we got. We have a Calgar as well in chat. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Calgar. Likely changes with evolution. That's very true. Irony is one. The optimal climate conditions for pollination are per variety. Humidity is a bigger part than temperature. Okay. Three. All research that has ever suggests certain temperatures to be optimal are all with specific light conditions. Okay. Having a static temperature would not make much sense for a fruit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. A brighter situation will make for a different temperature range with the addition of small but still present alteration okay. of the optimal humidity range. Okay, that was the short version. <laughs> okay, well, let's see what the book says. <laughs> the book is not always right. Okay. Um, the question was the optimal temperature for pollination is 18.5 Celsius or 65.3 Fahrenheit. I do appreciate that it gave the conversion, so I didn't have to figure it out. Oh my gosh, y'all. The book says it's true! <laughs> uh -oh. Uh -oh. Freaky is about to go on the warpath. Uh oh. Burn it. Did you not fact check the book, Freaky, before you gave it to me? He's in hot water now. <laughs> oh, I mean, the dad jokes really have come through, but clearly the trivia leaves something to be desired. Okay, there we go. All right, let's try this. pages would have been removed. You have to censor it appropriately. <laughs> um, he's freaky. We've, we've met Freaky a couple of times now, but on the last visit, he gave me a trivia book, the dad jokes book, and the jokes to offend men book. So... I guess you can blame Freaky. <laughs> you can always blame Freaky. <laughs> if there is. Uh, content, not to your liking. Well, that's true. You could, you could use it as fertilizer, potentially. You could. Okay. 
Shall I move on from tomato questions, maybe? You might aggravate some more of the team if you uh, do that. <laughs> we'll move or on if, from... If you don't do that, I should say. Yeah. I mean, we can go back to sports and leisure where none of us ever know the answers. Okay. Uh, did we also... Ha! Rotor 2. It's very hard to find a good trivia book. I have tried. <laughs> Oh my gosh. American sports is a category. Weld pad B. E. Okay, that's that done. Did I name these? I didn't name these properly. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm, most of these I'm like, what is that? Or the Spice Girls, always good. Some extra ones to annoy final. Sports will do that for sure. Oh, here we go. The unusual sports festivals. I feel like I've gone through most of these now. Where do you want the controls for this? Alien, you want it upstairs or do you want it down here? I'm just looking. I think I've read most of these. have I think I've read all of these oh no oh no oh no oh no yes I remember some of these are very weird okay we can't do any of them I've read them all hmm let's go let's see what we got for history Oh, I have a thought about this. Oh, ancient though. Rome. We can see how often Ow. you all are thinking of the Roman Empire. Yeah, well, there's... Uh, okay. Well, bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Here we go. We'll, we'll start off. When was the city of Rome founded? Question is, when was the city of Rome founded? Save. And a weld pad be off. <laughs> How often are you thinking of the Roman Empire? I feel like somebody would know this. Somebody. They're very smart people that attend our streams. I'm always like, wow, these people know so many things. I read all of these trivia questions. I'm like, I don't know the answer to any of these. I'm hearing some clanging about over there. What are you clanging doing? Clanging about. What are you doing? What am I doing? Yeah, what are you doing? I'm eating rations. Yeah, okay, all right. I, am, I don't think I'm doing anything to... Yeah, I don't believe you. Anger <laughs> clang. I don't, do not believe you. There we go. Okay. Now that I have eaten. That in, in school. There's a Calgar. General schooling was a ways away for me then. The memory of it is very weak. Uh, where's the well? There it is. Uh, alien built this place. Kelgar. I'm just, what? uh, tweaking it. Okay. When was the city of Rome founded? According to the book, 753 BCE. 753 BCE. Here you go, Neff. All right, what other history? I know this group normally likes history questions, but we need, as Ricky is suggesting, the children's <laughs> section. This is gonna be another hangar, Calgar. And I think that it's going to go out, eventually it'll go out to the side. So I feel like focusing on this one will help because we can put more skill miners in here. Oh, 
here we got geography. All right, what have we got for geography? Volcanoes. Do we like volcanoes? Project or arm. Oh, another true or false. Australia has no active volcanoes. True or false. Australia has no active volcanoes. True or false. Well, it's pad B. Arm. Okay. Geography, everyone's favorite. But if I do true or false, you get a 50-50 shot. And let's turn the velocity up. Do I have... Let's grab this one. So I'm mostly already full of materials. Can I put this away somewhere? There we go. And then... I grab those. Aha, Lovely. It does hit that. Okay. Australia, there probably is one. I I mean, it's right. It's a large s space. Restart in 15 minutes. Oh, no. Volcano full of venomous spiders and predatory animals. <laughs> Oh, that's true. Oh, games an underwater volcano would be hmm. would be an option. Let's do. Is this the place displacement? The maximum? It is the maximum. Okay. Need to tweak this a touch, alien. <laughs> okay, Australia has no active volcanoes. True or false? Where are we looking? Quiz one six. 15? Apparently true. If that's actually true, who knows? Apparently they, there are no active volcanoes. And... That was five. What else have we got? Oh, film and TV. <laughs> children's TV shows. Here we go, Freaky. Now we're in the children's category. Okay, let's go over here and let's turn on... Google says wrong. Google says wrong. I don't know. I don't know. Volcanoes in Australia, they are rare in Australia because there are no plate boundaries on this continent. Yeah, okay. Two active volcanoes located 4,000 kilometers southwest of Perth in the Australian Antarctic Territory. Well, I don't know. We're gonna have to find a different trivia book. Or maybe we have to just get rid of trivia and just do bad jokes. <laughs> Cause then we know that they're not true. It's true. At that point, we know they're not true. Mm hmm Okay. We've got that figured out. That's excellent. Oh, here we go. You ready, everybody? Children's TV shows. Which 1970s TV show stars Big Bird? Which 1970s TV show stars Big Bird? That's why you should go visit uh, the other planet there, Turnip. For Big Bird? Yeah. <laughs> We're looking for Big Bird. <laughs> We're looking for Big Bird. <laughs> Let's put a helm down here. You want to make a bad joke now? <laughs> well, we can pass the trivia, but...
What I am concerned Oof. about is that there will be not enough space to get a sco miner through. Hello, blood to tell and pip. It's pip. I assume you. <laughs> I think it's pip. Uh, I think I should just probably call you just call you pip. Uh, hi, pip. Uh, what are we building? Uh, well, I'm building a thing that a friend of ours by the name of Alien decided Ooh. to start building. This is a hanger. Uh, this hanger. Uh, will be one of the hangers that we use in this space. This particular thing we're making right this very moment is a welder. So this is uh, this is a weld pad. So there's a bunch of welders underneath here, and then this is a rotary uh, a rotary welder. So we have a arm that spins around, and then this will spin, and this will spin. And I've added, I've tweaked Alien's design a bit. Um, so it's a piston that will allow us to change the width of the printer. Uh, and you just loaded into the sound of gunfire. Must be parody. So, uh, you are correct. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the team. Maybe what I have to do. That could work. I could adjust it. After just right. building this, I'm going <laughs> to... Okay. Put some things on here. Trivia. Question. Which 1970s TV show stars Big Bird? Off the block on off. And then we'll do... Answer is Sesame Street. I was curious if it got it right. Wow. <laughs> Kramer versus Kramer versus <laughs> That'd be... I'm gonna go toggle block on off. Uh, we're probably also gonna do toggle block on off here. Good work. What else is for... Oh, 1980s films. There's oh, a... here we go. Oh, go ahead. No, no. I'm just looking at there's a weld pad B projector already. Weld pad B projector. Where is this? I don't know. Okay, everybody. 1980s films. What year did Marty McFly go back to in Back to the Future? What year did Marty McFly go back to in Back to the Future? Yeah. Uh, because I don't know if you want to see that, Neff. Why is there a channel point redeem for final carrying Skoka, but not one for Skoka carrying final? I can't carry final. Excuses. I can't. Excuses. <laughs> just constantly. I have noodly little arms, and it's not going to happen. Just, just making excuses, team. <laughs> Uh, where's the freaking... Oh, I need more concrete. That's Is there no inertia tensor on a rotor? I swore there was. 56. Oh, this is 57. Okay. Also, hello, Malloy. 65. 1960. 55. Yeah, because he starts in the 80s. Oh, I have a little bit of concrete. I need some more concrete. Wow, one yeah, concrete. Yeah, there is a shear nurse sensor. I knew there was. I knew it. You knew it. Knew it. You're so smart. I am very smart. <laughs> okay, those are done. Yes, he went forward because then everybody was writing news articles about like the future was supposed to be. <laughs> today and we were going to have like hover cars and it was going to be great let's see what year did marty mcfly go back to and back to the future 374 apparently 1955 
You wouldn't get it. Winter! Woohoo! Good work. Uh. <laughs> Holy shit. If I... I... Put a block. It's the piston. There we go. Okay. Can I get rid of this and make it a slope? Which the name of this one? Will that make it better? Was what I'm trying to do is make this entrance so that it actually works as a hanger, but we could still get a miner through it. Okay, that's that done. Probably not turnip. It's not going to be the most beautiful. I don't think it's gonna work. I don't wanna have to seal this in. And just like make a wall, that's not great. Maybe I have to remove this glass panel. That's what the piston's for. But then that'll for, block yeah. this. I'm gonna test by printing a uh... Uh, I'm gonna, I'll test by printing a skull miner. But I think the way I'm going to make sure that this works is by using a, a piston. Or, yeah, using the piston and a sensor. So if I do this... It's not going to work here. So. Let's make sure that's the right rotor. Uh, Other options include this one. This needs a breaking torque of somewhere up here. Because I don't have a lot of space to play with in this. I could go up. I could go up. Also go. Let's configure that other rotor while we're thinking about it. Weld pad B. We still have a couple more trivia questions, so we'll get to those in a moment. Building up there, totally fine. And we'll get rid of these. Uh, projector. Diamonds. Projector one, toggle block on off. You know what, let's just get rid of the components for these lights, because it's going to take me forever to be able to make those. And we'll go blueprints. Clear that out. Do we want another skull miner? Do we want a... Um, do we want another skull miner? Do we want a... Uh, uh, another hag D? Any other requests? thinking about things to print because oh, I'm going to have to print I'm going to have to print something here as a test okay so if I put this back in because this is where this has to be work within our constraints here let's do TMS we always need more skill miners. TMS 5 1. Copy to clipboard. See, my only other thought is that I could go. Let's up. get rid of this. Let's do this. Let's go to projector. So we could do. This, and we'll do on off, and then we'll do. Increase horizontal, decrease horizontal, 
We'll do increase vertical, decrease vertical, increase. Oh, so server restart in one minute. Oh, okay. Everybody get to your bed. I'll get to a chair. I'm not going to make it. I died in here, so I need to get somewhere else. Um, take those. Here we are. All right. Back to trivia. 1980s films was good. Let's see if there's another one that's interesting. Run! <laughs> I don't think I'm going to make it downstairs in time, so I'm just going to sit in this seat. Just find, find a chair. Yeah, but I needed a pressurized room. Yes. Because otherwise I was going to die. Oh, here we go. 1980s films. What has been banned in the film Footloose? What has been banned in the film Footloose? Got all the Triton just passing over. He's 18 in the movie. His parents are like 18 in the past. So 29 year difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You couldn't approximate the math on that one. We can all hang out in the lobby. Hanging out in the lobby. Just lurk here with the with the waiting music. Difficulty hard. Oh, it's definitely not default settings, Pip. <laughs> not on Paradiso. We're not even on Paradiso. <laughs> we do have a mod list. Is she mod list? Band within the story or something IRL. Hmm. says <laughs> good acting was banned. <laughs> I mean, it's true. <laughs> Apparently, I have a GPS that's new. Um, it is the film. The category is 1980s films. Oh, that's zero 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 up there. Huh. All right, where's three seventy four? Okay, what has been banned in the film Footloose? The book says the answer is dancing. Yeah, but it's not. It's not the server start. Well, I mean, <laughs> it kind of does, but not not that way. First off, we're running Nexus, so that changes things a little bit. And then it doesn't change the actual, like, start shutdown method. Um, but it does change the fact that we're also on a modded planet, which changes the atmosphere settings, which changes how fast your body can die. All right, what other film and TV questions can we do? We also have a different cleanup for bodies, so. Some of these are like, you're like, oh, this will be easy. No, it's not. It is not. There's a whole section for war films. Also, Alien's back. I've made changes to your welding arm, Alien. Disney films? All right. That could be... That could be good. Fun sounds. What? Where am I? Oh. <laughs> it's like... What is going on over here? Oh, okay, Disney. What have we got? I feel like if we go Disney, we have a broad range. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Turn up. You're not dead yet. Yet. Uh, I am picking this one because I love this film and I forgot that it was. Uh, in the Princess Diaries, 
Mia Thermopolis is the heir to the throne of which fictional European country? In The Princess Diaries, Mia Thermopolis is the heir to the throne of which fictional European country? I completely forgot about that. I've watched that many a time. Uh, and then we'll go... So... <laughs> I like the shoe. <laughs> like, I knew that I knew this one at one point. Hello, Drifto. Oh, so God. many icons. I have careful do. management. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now I think what I'm going to do. I have a plan for this door. I just have to figure out where... Where Where's I... my sensor block? Here we go. Okay. So what we can do is we can put the door up here. And then just put a little slope. I hear a storm. And Bob's here. Here. Hello, Griffin. You're alive. Always a good thing. Exactly. Look at, the, look at the positive. Body is trying to fall apart, though. I am sorry. That's not great. That's somebody's unknown signal we're trying to kill again. Uh, I don't have one. Well, Calgar's here, so it might be Calgar's. There we go. Sorry about the badger suit. I have another way method for you to consider alien. We're gonna test it. So this is left. So I want only the left extent. Uh, we're gonna go. If I want the country for the ten meters. The it's a trivia question. So if you know the answer. You can extent. answer. I'm not even gonna look at the book. I know. That. One meter. Detect players off. Audible proximity on. Detect small ships. Detect small subgrids. Okay, so that has detected a subgrid. So. Front extent. Point five. Oh. So I'm thinking we gotta have the door. The ramp can go here if we block this in. Back extent zero. zero. That might not work. if we could do oh it would have to be on here okay so let's try this no that drift is correct it's genovia <laughs> now everybody's homework is to go and watch the princess diaries okay nobody watched legally blonde when i assigned it as homework Another disappointment for me, personally. She's mad at you now, team. <laughs> uh, let's try... I don't know how I'm going to get this door to work, y'all. I don't know how you're going to get that door to work, either. I don't know how I'm going to get it to work. Because I can put... We have to do some kind of sloping to get down here. And it 
probably have to be through this spot. But then that's going to leave a weird dent. Don't plug. Pretty sure we've na annoyed the entire neighborhood. Pit. It's pretty normal. Is this enough headroom? I know the vent could be moved. I'm just trying to work with. Here your plate. What we got. That's enough headroom. Okay. Tomat on sensor. Where is it? There it is. Yoink. We just will still need, yeah. Not gonna be able to fit a miner through this, so I'm gonna have to change it. Yep, you are. None of I tried. I, I know. tried to engineer it. I know you tried. Uh, okay, bottom extent. A Kanuki movie night in the Discord. Could we do that? Is that a thing that could happen? Uh, maybe. Point two five. And I can force you all to watch these films. Back extent zero. <laughs> Front extent ten meters. Right extent five. Left extent five. Okay, it's fine. Detect players off. Detect small ships. Detect subgrids. And detect. All those. No more space in suit inventory. Now, when this is set up, I want the piston. Because then, where would I put it? Probably along this way. Old pad, piston, B, protector arm. So when it detects, I want it to extend. When it does not detect, I want it to retract. And with that in mind, let's do... Legally Blonde is a great film. It's all about dependence now. Detect players. Very much so. See? Aha! You nailed it. Ah! I did. Excellent. Yes, I know now. you can't stream a movie unless you have certain... You meet certain requirements. Velocity. We're going to go to one. How is this set up? That's good. Uh, excuse me a moment while I go figure out what is clanging over here. Many a clang. Cookie Monster? Oh gosh. I think it's this Cookie Monster. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it's this. No. Hello, Thunder Fox. Welcome. Is it not the Cookie Monster? Today? Is it this? Because I can move the vent this is locked up. in. Right, I don't know. We could do that. Check the small hangers. I don't know. I'm pretty sure the clanging is coming from right here. All right, I still have two trivia questions to go. You have two trivia questions to go? Yeah, I'm keeping track on a piece of paper. As soon as I move this piston, as soon as this piston is moved, it decides, oh no, I wanna, uh, the clanging in the other room starts, lol. <laughs> All right. right. Ooh, spicy secrets. Take players off. It's literally about spices. <laughs> okay. All right. What is the most cultivated spice crop in the world? Trivia question is, what's the most cultivated spice crop in the world? 
Okay, there we go. Does everyone see my logic? I hope they do. Let's engage the... There's... Ooh, right, I'm in a chair. That's why I can't move. Rotor. <laughs> Genius. Let's go weld pad. Rotor. You say a bell pepper freaky. Okay. Or mustard. Mustardy Chili. One. Sugar. Yeah. There it is. Excellent. Start the rotation. We have the rotation. And so we see that it's doing the things. It's going to rotate. The rotisserie. The rotisserie. It's going to rotisserie this miner. It's going to rotisserie. And it should, in theory, because I've shared the inertia ten tensor on all of the things, mm -hmm. hopefully support this. So who knows? If it all explodes, it's not my fault. Are we ready? It's absolutely your fault. Is everybody ready? Wait, where are you? You want to come see this explosion happen? I do. Okay. <laughs> where? Where's the explosion? Uh, it is in the um, new hangar that... Uh, Downstairs? Upstairs? That's on the garage deck. On the garage deck. So I have to go, go up one. Go all the way to the very, very back. There we go. Okay. Push the button. Hmm? I think Calgar's already built those. No, uh, not all the of them. Button. Some of them are okay. Is this the correct button? It is the correct button. Remember to close the doors behind you. I am. See, I close the door behind me. And I'm waiting to make sure that they close. I'm adding to the suspense of the moment. Are you back in here? Looks like it. You have to go all the way through the red door. All the way through the red door. That assumes my build plan oh, works, alien. Door. Okay, go, go, go. It's taking so long to get here. Jeez. It's a long, it's a large base. Okay, you see the uh, the thingy? Yeah, I see where you're standing in a, a control area. Yep. Okay, here we go. So, we turn on the the first part of the rotisserie. Turn on the yeah. second part of the rotisserie. Uh-huh. We turn on the chicken. Yeah. There is the chicken. Uh. Yep. Okay. I see the chicken. Let's let's get ready to see if it explodes. Uh-huh. Well, there's on. It's already bending. It's working! See my piston thing? <laughs> it bounces the the, <laughs> okay. the welder up and down. <laughs> okay. The unfortunate part is it's not... I already know the title for this YouTube video, and it's Rotisserie Chicken. The rotisserie Chicken? Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to get some screenshots for you. Toy Imp would like to see this. That Clang, is that you? Uh, it's, uh, it's close. It's close. <laughs> I enjoy how the rotor has stopped working. It's just now bouncing on an angle. Yeah. Do you know where this is? The the range on the weld, uh, welders is uh, is vanilla pip. Also, Madwack, uh, you're watching a chicken rotisserie. It's a rotisserie <laughs> printer. It is a rotisserie printer. It works. Do you know what the inspiration <laughs> for this was? I don't know. This is if you if you watch the 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 videos in the startup menu of Space Engineers, there's a zero G version of this with a bunch of pistons, but the welders are on the pistons, and they're backing in and out of the range of the grid. This is the same concept, it's just the other, I'm moving the grid instead of moving the um, 
the piston, the welders. Okay, let's find the rotor. It keeps this doing what it's doing. Let's try... 1.5. There we go. Let's try... Let me read the answer to the trivia question while we're watching this potentially break. A little bit. Uh, and yes, I believe it is spice. Not like spicy. It's in heat, but spice like... Spice trade. <laughs> yeah, increasing the torque worked. Okay. But it could also be spice. I'm not sure. The questions are sort of weird. Let's see. According to the book, <laughs> what's the most cultivated spice it crop would be, in the alien. world? Oh, apparently chilies. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Why close the doors? Because then things will rust if we don't. Can anyone join the game? Well, technically, Thunderbox. <laughs> technically. Technically. This is a community server. But there are a couple of hoops you have to jump through. More than a few. Uh, this is not a vanilla game by any means. Yep. So it is more difficult so we like to uh let's try this have a disclaimer up front um you'll have to join the discord um and we ask that you do an introduction of yourself let me know you're not a bot um and then we can let you into the discord and from the discord there's a form that you have to fill out about the community server so that we can get you access to it there is we have a couple of hoops to jump through. More than a few. This, okay, so sharing an answer tensor on that some interesting doesn't experiences. Help. And we want to make sure that we can safeguard it to some degree. Oh, can I stand, sit in one of these to charge? Yep, you can. And I think that's all the things I need to weld on this thing. It's chilies. Yes, the book is wrong. Technically correct. Many different varieties. It is a complicated process. Once you've filled in a server application um, form, you get access to all of our servers for as long as we have servers. Yep. Um, or Not just I this add one. Add the sensor. This one. We're going to put a couple of thing control setups on here. So we're going to go sensor. This one over here, we're gonna go. Oh, it's no explosion. Toggle block on off. And we're gonna go with piston. Okay. This will be this one here. And it will be uh, toggle block on off. And it will be projector arm. And it will be retract. It's more bouncy now. Yeah, it's because I turned off one of the rotors or one of the things. We have one more trivia question. Let's find a different category. The natural world. Okay. What have we got? Here you go. Since this has been on finals mind today. Category. Size matters. Oh, Hello? this is one that the book might surely get wrong. I'm sh <laughs> what? What is the largest living toothed mammal? What is the largest living toothed mammal? What a question! Oh, hi. Hello. How's it going? It's going. It's going. I, I just heard an explosion. Awesome. That's what we're after. I know. I think the welder missed the antenna. Oh, the antenna's right there. What did the, what is that? What is that normally? 
It's a block that it's missing. I never remember. Oh, that's maybe the sorters. Maybe the sorters? Maybe the sorters. But there you go. That is yeah. the swelder demonstration complete. Sorters, they never print. Interesting. Well, I mean, not really relevant. The sorters are kind of useless in this world. I wonder why the sorters don't print. That's them right there. Ham should be ready to go on this thing. Nice. Alright. I assume that's you, Thunderfox. It just added to the Discord. So then you'll find um, a channel called Community Server Info. Give that one a read. May I exit the, the yes, you can. Oh, I can use this one. I'll just go. Yeah, before you do that. Mm-hmm. Before you close that. Ah. After you. Thank you. They physically print, oh. but they never show up on the hopper. Ah, okay. Hello, code. You walked into the twerking miner, yeah. Yes, you did. This is what happens if you start a weld pad and then final finishes. <laughs> This is exactly what happens. <laughs> okay, let's read the answer to the trivia question. What is the largest living toothed mammal? What a question. The book says the answer is the sperm whale. Good job. There you go. We should, uh, we Your can audit that Your daughter is right, Turnip. Nailed it! Did you see how I configured the um, sensors, Alien? For the other doors? I didn't close this door. Didn't did not look at the black magic sensors. Okay. Let me go park this go miner. Get back over here. Stop being a problem. Give her a round of applause. Woo! We have so many skill miners. There we go. There we go. Amazing. Applause. Applause. There you go. So that's another skill miner done. Excellent. Let me show Alien how to automate those doors. So I have to get rid of. So this door oh, actually. Right. I have a full backpack. I have to get rid of my full backpack first. Hello. There we go. Uh, cool. Copy settings. Uh, copy all but name. And show you. So over here, there, that's what we want. Which way is this door configured? Water. This one is with the top that way, so the top should go this way. We also need, what? okay, that's something else clanging up. Ah. Yeah. I think it's this. I don't know. You just built a clang machine and you're like, what is clanging? Not all of it's locked, alien. Uh, is this hangar A? I think this is hangar A. You can copy with the radio wheel, alien, yeah. It's because you're locked to a subgrid, that's why, alien. Oh, I should probably, like, I'm healing, yeah? Do we have a... No, we don't have a medical station in the barracks. That seems an oversight. Yep. Let's 
Get rid of all of these things. Sensor. Add. Close. Is this Do some healing? Lee. Here we go. For my scheme to make this work properly. Uh, pull one. There we go. Pull that. There we go. Okay. So this sensor. If I do this right, which I think this one is two blocks away. Yes. Two blocks away. So the only one that we're going to use off to the side here is this one. Go here. There we go. And then all the rest of this is going to have to go. I think we can do it. Paste. Because you saw, so the miner that was just printed, that's what has to get through here. So if I have this line of blocks, it's not going to fit nicely. Okay, let's go back over here. Let's rename this. What's the name of this door? Probably D. door. Okay, so what I did, alien was I made it so that this sensor um, is basically looking for small grids or yeah, small grids. I think it's looking for large grids. You know, it's just small grids, small grids inside the, the range of the entire yellow area. So it's looking for everything inside of this space. And oh, because, because, because sensors working. are sensors are event based. So when something enters, that's the, on event, and when it leaves, that's the uh, exit event. Um, during that time, it doesn't change. So when it goes through this space, it'll open. So if I do this with a player, and as long as the sensor settings are done right, it's not picking me up yet, but I walk in and it would open. So it's not working now. If I go over here and I go set up actions, and this is D, right? Hangar door D. Oops. Full vent. Garage door D. What are the. Check this. Oh, garage beauty. Door D. So. Beauty. With garage door D, and I go over here and I go set up actions. Garage. That needs to be inside here, door. right? I think D. That's how it works. For here, on detection, you want it to open, and on undetection, you want it to close. Because the first slot is what happens if something is in, No. I and the second it. slot is what happens when it leaves. So when it comes into sensor range, it's going to open. When it leaves sensor range, it's going to close. So if Wait, I step in... Then I step out, closes. But if I step in, it goes back to open. The the one where you have the open close, the toggleable state, that one, that when you use that on a sensor, it has a chance of messing you up because it will just toggle on off. Whereas you want it to open if something's in the sensor range, not to toggle on off back and forth. So now that I'm in sensor range, the door will open and close. Look at you go. I know. Um, so with that in mind, to be here. I'm gonna turn this off players now. So it won't detect players, but then we can fly through with vehicles and stuff. Will this work? Um, I need a cargo container. You can do the same thing with players and these regular doors too, alien, if you want. What I want. So then the door is here. We brick all of this in. What was I gonna do? After I trap myself. Pick some water, that's what I'm gonna do. Right, I'm just gonna go back to the welder. Ah! 
on. Thank you for following Thunderbox. I appreciate it. Speaking Energy of. Hello again. Did I check the Discord? See. You see? See, someone did a thing. I did. You did. Look at me go. And. Oh. Ah. Let me just quickly check. Tequila. Well, I'm Shadow. Thank you for the follow. My notifications work again, by the way. Oh, good. <laughs> Let me check. I need to check our application form. Just in case. That is your task, yes. It doesn't always trigger. I feel like I'm I'm nearly there. <laughs> I'm really stretching my brain today, okay? Are you? I'm not good at this sort of stuff. Are you? <laughs> okay. You all know I'm not good at this sort of stuff. <laughs> Danger. Help. Help. Low. Okay. So is that a, a fun welder setup, Alien? I think it does what it needs to do. Uh, we can fit three oh, more projectors on nice here. It would be nice if I could go... If we want them. In one more. Could we go in one more? Because we need to get rid of this row here. Uh, yeah, this has to go. Okay. Yes, more projectors. Yeah, I figured. Um, on here, Calgar. On this section above the these pistons, let's make sure that we increase the height. These are meant to be like garage, like vehicle lifts. So it's probably worth. Do you want to have the ceiling up here, Alien? Like off of this block. Higher than that. Okay. All right. So Alien hasn't even mocked out the height that he wants. So let's maybe just leave empty spots for them. Are my favorite hobbies? Oh, that's a great question. Okay, so that's done. We can do this. I have a lot of, I have a lot of hobbies. <laughs> we can do this. Like gaming, clearly. I do a lot of reading. It really crafting. does a lot of reading. It's very like... annoying. <laughs> And I was like, reading, it's so boring. So boring. It's so boring. Oh, gee, so boring. Well, I set myself a goal to read 40 books this year, and I'm at, hold well, no, on, let me check. Let me check so I have the correct number for you. I am currently at 37. I've read 37 books this year. So I think we're gonna hit 40 books, which I'm pretty excited about. And go over I like here. Puzzles, too. Puzzle games. I like word games. <laughs> Crosswords. <laughs> We're going to set this mic up. I like to up. cook. I like to bake. But I know a lot of people who read, like, way more books than that. <laughs> So I'm always like, I don't read that many books. <laughs> Next load seventy percent. Announced. Ah. Forward only. So I just changed a setting in the PAM settings, in the advanced PAM settings, 
mm-hmm. alien. Um, try getting the ham to only drill when it's going forward. That way, it will not. Um, it might. The chances of it overloading on stone the way back are less. It may still overload because they're rather special sometimes, but it's the chances are reduced. Let's see if it. I wanted oh, to see. Does the reinforced conveyor count as like a sealed block? No. No. Only on one side. Or two sides. Should two sides that are... If you press tab... Or, sorry, no. You see that little box on the left-hand side of yeah. your screen? Yeah. That should say which... The, the, how many sides are airtight. Okay, two. Okay. So which are the two that are airtight? Uh, if you press Control-P, it will tell you which sides are airtight. Or not Control... Uh, Control-plus. Sorry. Do I have to place it first? Nope. It'll do overlays in the box. So if you do control yeah, plus. Yeah, okay. I, I think that's what I want. in space school. What is this one's number? 5-7. TMS. Oh, that's what. But you know what? I could just do the one concrete block here. And then that would probably solve. Oh, I don't. What if I don't want this overlay anymore? I uh, just cycle through them again. So Control Got it. Got Plus it. again. Thank you. The overlays from Build Build Info are really helpful, but they're not always full. Did I see Five Nights at Freddy's? My goodness, no. Absolutely not. <laughs> Does an air vent have count as airtight on certain sides? Oh. Uh, an air vent should be pressurized on all sides. The full okay. size one. Lovely. It's, uh, it's trying to shortcut back to the next waypoint, Alien. That's why. It thinks it's in its path. Ooh, come on. Oh, no. What's the thruster? Uh oh. Okay. Oh, and another trivia question. Got it. Let's do another trivia question. Uh, got lost two thrusters. Okay. All right. We'll see what it got. Yep. Two thrusters. Okay. What haven't we looked at? Art and literature. These ones are always really difficult. <laughs> And they haven't really been, uh, they haven't gone over super well. So I'm going to skip through. Unless, what about children's classics? Yeah, we I might be okay on this one. Take my way out of here. Just use the classic way of getting out of here. All right, what have we got? In here? Oh, they look oh there's some good ones. Not that we need any. All right, children's classics. Trivia question. Which book features the character Christopher Robin? Look, some more Rex. Which book features the character Christopher Robin? This way? This way. 1.7 kilometer run. Here we go. There you go. Oh, actually, <laughs> I can jetpack skim all the way back. This we are blocking in 
here. So I will finish getting rid of this. I'm gonna run out of hydrogen. You're running out of hydrogen. Yep. I've run out of hydrogen. Uh -oh. Descent imminent. Yes, descent imminent. Thank you, Lucian. <laughs> By the way, you're gonna die. Alright, you know, it's not the most beautiful, but it might work. <laughs> Blood and honey. <laughs> Area over pistons is removed. Excellent. Because I can put the door here now. How many? Oh, I still have a bunch of concrete. Something that occurs to me. Mm hmm. We, uh, oh. There's a parallax shadow attacking, attacking a wandering merchant. Excellent. Um, as far as I heard, I thought Turnip Town's defenses got wiped out. We can airtight from this side. Or we add more roof. So we might have to go visit them at some point. Mm-hmm. And send a fleet of go miners. Uh, yeah. Made on the... A rotisserie. It's true. A fleet of skull miners and uh, a uh, to go uh, weld up all the defenses. Yeah. Danger. Health low. Health low? Really? Health low. Alright, let's get the answer to the trivia question. Okay. Oh, look, the ramp is still intact. That's good. <laughs> I haven't been outside today yet. Quiz. Calgar did build a hover tank. It's true. Yes. Okay, which book features the character Christopher Robin? Answer is Winnie the Pooh. A classic. Uh, do I have enough? I cannot withdraw. One metal grids and 90 voters. Uh, do you have a helicopter around here somewhere? Alien, you do. And then we'll do a P e. that just needs to be airtight on one side. We may need our group set up. Is there anywhere else I could put? I haven't tried anything with the new uh, thrusters. Mm. We could stick it. Because if I stick the... Where? You've run out of hydrogen. Yes, yes, I know. <laughs> Solution. All right, let's Bad go over here. D. Like so. You will need a charge then 19 minutes. Ah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Because then if I stick the vent here, well, that that's not airtight. was the replacement from the explosive flights. I still haven't yeah. found your issue. Oh, yeah. We have to go outside. We have to go outside? Yep. Yeah, Calgar says we have to go outside. Okay. I got a charge. Hold on. Edie thinks that ought to be slightly slimmer. This particular um, vehicle, you mean? Oh, I should maybe park this inside. Yeah, probably. That parallax shadow is getting closer. 
Mm-hmm. It's just wiped out something that's coming your, our way. Hmm. Okay. Oh, hold on. Look at that. See, that's what we needed. There is the proper entrance for this area. Perfect. So we fixed that problem. Okay. Yeah, part. Running up. I assume that's an unknown signal. Potentially. Oh. oh. The incompatible West weapon is listed above. Schedule for Oh, wow. I've missed some things. Yes. Skoka's missed a few things. I've missed a few things. Look at this. This is the... Uh, the statue. The statue. Huh. Have I set the minimum targeting size yet? No. Okay. Uh, probably sh I, I guess I could. I don't know if the button works. Because uh, I, I don't think the flares stick around. Check shade. Let me have a look. Fireworks launcher is bugged. Oh my gosh, is fireworks launcher? That's fun. Yeah. Okay, so let's look at trombones. Oh, we've got a friend over there. Okay. Uh, shop delay, bell mode, small grid, target subsystems, target grids. And the, si and the size control is a hotbar okay. action. You've taken a lot of damage. Oh. Let's find the med station. Oh, yeah, there's some flare guns now. Okay. Um... Flare gun, very nice. Are you sure about that, BD? Oh, size control is a hot bar action. Sorry, dirt. <laughs> Thought you said slide bar or something, and I was like, wait, what? What are you talking about? Oh, we about? have a camera out here now for security purposes, probably. Probably. Make sure. Safe. Uh, Flare launcher too. Okay, very stormy. What are we doing up here? Groups. Sun is still mostly Trombone. intact. <laughs> <laughs> Max size, min size, increase, decrease, min size, increase, in size, increase, oops, nope, in size, increase, in size, decrease, min size, let's go okay. with. Ooh. Don't really want to deal with the, the burning oh. fire at the moment. Two, four, six, eight, sixteen. 16 blocks? It's probably big enough. Potentially. And let's also do... Now, I have an alarm on my phone that says we're supposed to take a break right now because we're going to try to do that with longer streams. Are we? But that's what you said. <laughs> well, then maybe it's back to break time. <laughs> I just, my system just ran an ad. Oh, maybe that's perfect timing. Well, no, we give it another minute or so, and then I, then we go BRB, and we actually, uh, I can run a longer ad. So can you? Because that way, you will not get pre rolls when people come to visit your stream. There we go. Uh, 
let's go min size Back decrease. There we go. So hotbar actions. I've set both the trombones and the specters to have a minimum size of 16. I hope you're not flying. I hope that's, right now. Ooh, that's appropriate. Dented. Because this is also another depleted. roof that needs to be, or ceiling that needs to be uh, filled in. The camera is called Ring Doorbell Camera. Check the weather before flights. Brilliant. TFM Industries, welcome. What keeps talking? Madwack, you mean like the, the suit voice, Madwack? Okay. Meteors as a world volume radius. Okay. Maybe we could put the vent on this side. That is... Okay, Madwack, that is our suit voice mod. Well, it's not our mod, but it's the one that we have in our mod list. <laughs> the one we're using. That's uh, Lucian. Uh, Lucian V. Ghost, who's another uh, Space Engineers content creator, streamer. Um, they have... They stream other stuff, but... Lucian made a mod that is sounds like them, and it's a replacement voice for the suit lady. I take no credit for this ship, TFM. This is um, this ship is made by our friend Alien, who was just here. No. Nope. And this particular red, which is actually it's it's a very nice looking it's helo, uh, is. Supposedly on this run, known to explode. So <laughs> I'm trying not to cause it to explode. So we put... What, suit lady? You mean, have you not heard the, the voice that the... Suit voice? AI, the suit voice? Tells you when your inventory's full, when you're running out of hydrogen, when you're out of O2. Yeah, Drifter's got it. Also, hello, Drifter. Wind. The wind Medical is stonk. This goes advised. here. There's a voice that would tell you that. <laughs> yes, coat. <laughs> it would also be so annoying. Potentially. Hydrogen reserves. Yes, yes, Lucian, I know. Don't stop, 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 stop. You're right over there. No. Come on. You look, you use the voice mod from Wasted Space, Snarky Sounds. Yeah, Snarky Sounds, yeah. Yeah, they're fun. Like all the different options for that. Giving you information when you need it most. Yeah, totally. Totally. That's that's it. Yeah, yeah. Hydrogen reserves depleted. I'm gonna have to fly back to base to get more parts. Cause that's not enough for that thing to fly. Is there one that tells you when your inventory is full? No, of course not. That would that would be helpful to know when your inventory is full? No, it tells you it repeatedly. Constantly. No, nothing would I mean, that wouldn't be it wouldn't be too much information. It would be relevant to our current situation. Mm-hmm. Okay. Fly this back. Do I have the I feel like we're slowly getting somewhere on this. On which? <laughs> on this uh <laughs> that I'm not doing a great job of trying to figure out this ceiling. Okay, fly all the way back. Oh my gosh, Turnip is waiting for the candy voice mod. <laughs> the drunk Skoka mod. The drunk Skoka mod, 
Yeah. The <laughs> valley girl accent. Oh my god. Your inventory is like so full. <sighs> hey, that flare works good. Works better than the other one I was using. Because I can, it, like, legit see. Even in the storm. Ship fuel reserves are low. Your ship fuel is low. Your ship fuel reserves low. <laughs> yeah. Yes, please. <laughs> we've we've said multiple times that Skoka should do this, it. and she's she's just balked at it every time. Uh, I haven't balked at it. It's just more work. <laughs> Gogo wants more work, Tim. Make more sure, work. make sure to let her know that that she needs to have more. Reserves depleted. It's more work, but it seems the the interest in it is growing. So perhaps I should add it to my to do list. You probably should, yes. I probably should, because it'll take a while to script it, record all of it. Yeah, you have to like legit script it. I have to script it. Because I, I don't actually know every single piece of dialogue that Suit Lady has. I mean, I feel like I do from playing the game for a while, but I'd have to check to make sure that it would, have, it would encompass everything. And then actually script it. Let's remove that. And then add... Only a few minutes worth of power. This. This. Working your way on the other side to set up a new bunker. Nice. Good choice. Apparently. I, think I should. All right. All right. I can add it to the to do list. Uh, BD says that you can mm -hmm. one shot players with those flare guns. Oh. So you need to be careful. Imagine if that voice just got more and more scary. <laughs> I already told you your hydrogen is low. I guess you do not want to fly much longer. <laughs> I hope you crash. <laughs> like, OMG, can you, Hi, like, OMG. not crash? Please and thank you. This is like the fourth time that I've told you. Oh my god. What do you look for again to join, Danger. Thunder Fox? Did Help. you fill no. in the form that is in, let me get the correct channel name, community server info. You have to fill in the community server seat application. <laughs> Almost, ooh, ee. Uh, Deca, Deca21, thank you for the follow. How's life being 21? Good number. It's a good number. Oh, oh, cheap. Good. Oh. Gonna run out of power down here. Block. Block. You've run out of also, hydrogen. I just realized that Kelva said that wouldn't be snarky. Hello, Kelva. Welcome, Kelva. Okay, that's that. Motors. <laughs> Isn't there something you should be doing besides sitting on that computer all day? It has to be appropriately sassy. It does. Yes. Of course we're having a hard time. Which here. I will have to record it drunk so that my voice hits the appropriate it's pitch. It's <laughs> true. You will have to do that. <laughs> Fright and shot down. Nice. Uh, I'm doing this for work, everybody. Clearly. Yeah. Part of the job. You should you can you can script it during Creative Club. Whoop no, it's script, yeah. <laughs> oh you wish you were still twenty one. Okay. Alright, that makes more sense, Tekka. Well, welcome, Good. regardless. Welcome, welcome. We are not ageist here. Oh. <laughs> we are many ages. We are many ages. 
Okay. Please don't crash this time. I don't think it will make you any promises. Uh, no, shit, stop. <laughs> Winter would think about playing if that was an option. What? How could we I make this worse? Right now. No. Oh. Well, you said we were gonna take a break. I'm just keep. I'm holding you to it because you'll forget. I know. I have to come back to it. Team, have you ever seen a rotisserie welder before? Now you have. If you enjoyed that, make sure to like and subscribe, and we will see you here next time.